Hello athletes and fans of bodybuilding, Tarek Elgindi with the Mr. Olympia. Now, if you're wondering why so many Canadian athletes are doing so well in the IFBB Pro League, the Toronto Super Show is the answer. The quality was incredible. Let's talk about bodybuilding. Mohamed Shaban comes in sharper and conquers his qualification. He still needs to get a little drier for the Mr. Olympia, but this guy has done his homework. Congratulations. I want to mention Theo Leguihier. He's a French competitor. I judged him in Tunisia in 2018 as an amateur. He's gained tremendous size, controlled his waist, and his guest posing routines are the best in the pro league. You gotta watch this guy. In the 212, we have Hosan Kalate. This guy has nice lines. He has great conditioning. He reminds me a little bit of Kamal when Kamal won the Olympia. He won't be the biggest 212 but his quality is incredible. Watch out for this guy. Classic physique, Tyler Johnson. Great back double biceps, impressive competitor. Now, once he goes to the Mr. Olympia, he's gonna have to work on that posing. You're dealing with some of the most genetically freaky guys in the world in the classic physique. So every pose in order to minimize the waist, but Tyler Johnson did a great job. Mehdi Kabaji from Morocco wins the men's physique. He's complete. He's ready to go. Full chest, nice V taper, obliques. Now the challenge is, can you maintain the same level of conditioning, the same level of quality physique to the Mr. Olympia? Sometimes guys, the feedback is don't change a thing. And that's exactly what I would tell them. Congratulations, young man. And then we have on the wheelchair, Woody Belfort. Man, this guy has arms for days. Great, great arms, great back double biceps. Nick Scott was there, I'm a huge fan of his. So we'll have another great star in the wheelchair division. Moving on to the ladies. Female bodybuilding, Lisa Kudre wins the female bodybuilding. I loved her posing routine. She did incredible, she did ballerina poses. I think we're experiencing a revival of female bodybuilding with the Linda Murray style of physiques. Congratulations, she'll be beautiful on that stage at the Mr. Olympia. In the women's physique and figure, we had a Korean invasion, yes. Ji Hai Lee wins the women's physique. She wasn't the most conditioned. She fell the criteria perfectly. She was in perfect condition. She didn't have any striations and her physique has great flow. Congratulations. One of the most impressive athletes was Han Wu Park. Yes, figure. From the back, she just killed it. She's an incredible competitor. I'm going to say that her and Mary Kabaji were the two people that really impressed me in this show. So she's also ready, doesn't need to do a lot in terms of feedback, but she was quite impressive. If there's somebody that can make an immediate impact in the Olympia, I might just say Henwo Park is ready to go. Wellness, we had the Canadian Super Blonde double down on winning the show. She is incredible on stage, great stage presence, beautiful competitor. If she adds a little bit more glutes, she can be unstoppable. Watch out for the Canadian Super Blonde. In the bikini division, we have Ashley Kohlwasser winning again, 34th. This woman has won everything. She might as well just win the lottery. She wins everywhere. She wins in Romania, she wins in Canada, she wins in the United States. I'm gonna tell you the secret. Her secret is she is unbeatable almost from the back. There's just, it's very hard to see her losing that back pose. Unless she's really tired, Ashley is always on fire from the back pose. She's consistent. She comes in every show looking great. So Ashley, congratulations. You're gonna go down the Hall of Fame of bodybuilders as one of the best. Stephanie Jones, fitness, came in with great energy. She had a pose there in her posing routine where she displayed great balance. I was impressed. She's gonna be at the Mr. Olympia. The Toronto Super Show was incredible. Guys, Canadian bodybuilding has Chris Bumstead, Jennifer Dory, Laura Lee Chapados, Ayan Valier, all these great competitors. They came from Canada. If you wanna see great bodybuilding, Canada is doing a great job. 
Miami Meso Beach happened this weekend. Yes, in Miami, we had a show where we had wellness competitors, one of them qualifying for the Mr. Olympia. Yes, a Brazilian one, Gisele Machado. She took her message from Sonny Andrews and said, hey, hold on now, we still have our place here. Gisele Machado is experienced. I judged her in 2018 at the Arnold Classic South America. She won her class. She won Romania Muscle Fest. Another Brazilian going on the Olympia stage. Men Sezik, we have Alex Toplin. He took second in New York, got better, came back and earned his qualification. Great job, young man. In the bikini, Sierra Swan won again. Get out of this woman's face. She's winning everything. She just doesn't care. She's on a roll. Last year, she took her feedback to heart and came back strong, and she's now on fire. Congratulations to all the competitors. This Wednesday, we're going to revise all the great athletes in the last couple shows. Pittsburgh Pro, Indy Pro, New York Pro, Cali Pro, and Toronto Super Show. We're going to revise all the competitors, and we're going to let you know who got the most attention from all of us, who impressed us the most. Joining me, none other, Jay Cutler, four-time Mr. Olympia and Chief Olympia Officer Dan Solomon. I'll see you at the Mr. Olympia.